Hi, welcome to Expertizer Academy. This is Giri Lecturer in Physics. In this video, we discuss about the oscillations in LC circuit. So, oscillations is nothing but a vibration of the wave. So, this oscillation is generated in LC circuits. L means inductor, it having the property inductance. C is the capacitor, it contains the capacitance property. Charge or voltage. So let's verify this oscillation in LC circuits. Whenever energy is given to a circuit, containing a pure inductor of inductance L and a capacitor of capacitance C, the energy oscillates back and forth between the magnetic field of inductor and the electric field of capacitor. Here, energy oscillates from inductor to capacitor. At inductor, magnetic field is developed. In inductor, there is a Conductor it carrying current after some time, the magnetic field is developed. In capacitor, the voltage is stored in, in between the two plates of the capacitor, then electric field is generates. Thus the electrical oscillations of definite frequency are generated. Thus, electrical oscillations of definite frequency are generated. These oscillations are called LC oscillations. Let us assume that the capacitor is fully charged with the maximum charge Qm at the initial stage, so that energy stored in the capacitor is maximum and is given by Q squared by 2C. As there is no current in the inductor, the energy stored in it is zero. That energy is zero. The total energy is wholly electrical. This is the shown in this figure. So look at here. At capacitor, the charge is very maximum. So that's why the energy in this capacitor Q squared by 2C is very maximum. But in inductor, the current is zero. So that's why this circuit is purely capacitive. Here, charge or energy in inductor AC. This is only electrical energy circuit. The capacitor now begins to discharge through the inductor that establishes current I in clockwise direction. Now, the current or energy in this capacitor is discharged in clockwise direction by the inductor. This current is passing through from passing from the capacitor to inductor. Here inductor energy is increased capacitor energy is decreased. Eh? 
This current produces a semantic field around the inductor and the energy stored in the inductor is given by L i square by 2. As the charge in the capacitor decreases, the energy stored in it also decreases and is given by Q square by 2C. Thus, there is a transfer of some part of energy from the capacitor to inductor. Here, the energy in the capacitor is zero. But in inductor, the energy is L i square by 2. This is only magnetic energy. When the charge is transferring from, the current is transferring from capacitor to inductor, the magnetic field is developed in this uh, inductor with the help of uh, and arranging the magnetic field lines. So this number of magnetic field lines representing the magnetic flux. Now, this is only magnetic energy circuit. Here, again, that energy is decreased. The energy is transferred from inductor to capacitor in anti-clockwise direction. So then, the energy at inductor is zero, but in capacitor is maximum. Now this is the only electrical energy circuit. Here electric field is generated. So this type of uh, rearrangements of energies at the capacitor and the inductor is repeatedly generates. So that's why here energy is transferring from the energy transfers from capacitor to inductor, inductor to capacitor. So mainly in capacitor, the electric field is generates. In inductor, magnetic field is generates. So the energy moving like a to and from motion from capacitor to inductor that means magnetic field to electric field, electric field to magnetic field. So this is the LC oscillations circuit or cycle. When charges in the capacitor are exhausted, its energy becomes zero. The energy is fully transferred to the magnetic field of the inductor and its energy is maximum. This maximum energy is given by L i m squared by 2, where i m is the maximum current flowing in the circuit. Here we discuss with the oscillations in LC circuit. In LC circuit, so that circuit contains the inductor and capacitor. At inductor, the magnetic field is generated by the flowing of current. In capacitor, the electric field is generated. The charge or voltage is developed in that two plates in capacitor. So the energy is moving or oscillates back and forth motion between the magnetic field of the inductor to electric field of conductor. Electric field at capacitor, not at conductor. So this is the information about the oscillation in LC circuits. So thanks for watching this video. For more videos visit www.expertizeracademy.com. Thank you.